Right then, there's a small yellow arrow that you can hardly see in the stinging nettles look. So I've just come down a very dodgy track, very wild. Doesn't look like it's hardly ever been used for a long time. Having to cross a small stream, I've done all that. That was, look, look how, how hardly seeable that is. This is short, this is certainly an adventure, I'll tell you that much. No wonder they don't sort of suggest it much. Certainly an adventure. Right then, so I've crossed the stream. I've come from right up there. I've walked right through that wood. It could be, um, what's the name of that wood again? Aller Park Coombe and all the woods around there. And um, so I'm now following this new track, which is wild, isn't it? I mean, it's almost as if they don't want anyone to come down here. I expect you get one or two, but it's not it's not been used by the holidaymakers, has it? Do you know what I mean? That has not been used. I mean, I think probably what you could have done is come around that bit here, but they've sent me across the track, and I followed it exactly as it said. But probably if you'd followed that wider one, you could curve round. But it's very boggy there. This is an adventure on its own, folks. It would have been so much quicker on the bus. Been there in five minutes. <sighs> no, this the part of the reason for walking that is exploring as well. Getting lost is a part of it. I think if I hadn't had this guide at all, it would have been very difficult to follow, to find. Uh, it would have been total. I wouldn't have known anything about coming down through here, for example. Um, no. You can probably follow that toll row all the way to that church. I don't even know if I'll make it there yet. Oh, I don't know, it depends how much further it, this is because as I'm walking along there's no indication of distance. Although I think right back there it did say three quarters of a mile. Well, that's quite a way. That's like walking from my old home in Barrow to the Tesco supermarket. Oh, if you know Barrow at all. Oh, we're coming to another sign now, everyone. I suppose we've got to go up hill again now, just for a bit of fun. I am feeling a bit better than I did when I first got up. My feet are, aren't very good, though, because of all this going downhill. My feet are... They're going to need to be soaked well when I get home eventually tomorrow. I can see why you don't see many people out here. I've strictly followed that pathway, but it looks to me like there's another one. It looks to me like there could have been an easier route for me. And it was only a mile. What they've done, I could have come somewhere like through there. I think there was another track. Um, I've actually followed this track. So here we go. let will turn off a minute, take a picture of this. So there was another route. Um, I followed this route, which is this harder route, I think. But that was an easier route. That probably... I don't really know where that went, but I think that's probably the way people go home. I don't think they go all up there. That's where I think I went wrong. Somewhere I went wrong. All right, over and out. Right, I'm carrying on <coughs> towards Porlock Weir, which is still saying three quarters of a mile. 
even though it's been saying three quarters of a mile, see what fun and games I'm having, even though it has said three quarters of a mile for at least an hour, um, I find that really weird, you know. Could have done without this really show, couldn't you say? You should have just gone straight on the bus like you planned. <sighs> Never mind. It's only because I'm really tired today. I am finding a struggle really today. <sighs> but I'm going to carry on. I've got to get to that weir. I'll decide then. I've had a rest. The idea, I just walked to the church and straight back. I'm not going to do the rest of it. I think if you followed this Coleridge walk, that would have been the easier one. I just followed this book it's this evening. For young foot people, it's fine. It's fine. I'm old, I'm fittish, but recovery is slower. I'm so glad I've done it in a way, because at least I know I've done it. But at least I know if I walk part back along the marshes, there is a bit pebbly bit. Um, but basically, it's flat. But it's supposed to be a strenuous walk, this next one. This is supposed to be the moderate walk, right? It's all relative to one's age and fitness. And what I've already and I've already done masses of walking. I've been up beacons, down beacons, up cairns, down them. Um, I've been walking for four days. So I've my energy levels are depleted a bit. I'm thinking of going into town, into Porlock, hoping there's something open this evening and eating out today. <sighs> that's what plan A is. Plan, that's plan A. I might not. I might just have pilchards, pilchards sandwiches and tomato soup <sighs> and pudding. It depends how I feel. See, we're coming onto blue signs now because there was a path. There was a ribbon across it. See, but we still got the Coleridge sign. We still got the Coleridge sign. See? Well done, Coleridge. The poets, the great minds are with me. I just turn off again now in case the camera suddenly goes off again. Right, so I came to a junction back there, the camera went off again. So everything I said back there at the the gate with the signs, I did take pictures of the signs, but the camera went off. For some reason I've no idea. 
Um, anyway, I'm heading for Poor Lot Weir now. I've, what I've done, I was just reading a paragraph out of there of what to do next, but I think I'll just do a little bit of videoing now. Um, it's still quite complicated ahead. But what I pointed out back there was um, the Coleridge Walk. Uh, the golden feather, the quill, turned up. And um, that was quite good, you know. So there is, and I think that there is, Coleridge Walk is separate to the one I've done. I think I'd have to, if I ever come back another time, I'll have to find out about that. Uh, this is now part of the Coleridge Walk, by the way. I've picked up now. It wasn't mentioned once at all by the person that wrote this this um, pamphlet. They never mentioned the Coleridge Walk. Uh, so I think the Coleridge Walk would have been easier. Um, I, I've done the harder route, actually, believe it or not. Um, and the longer route, I the sign of it. It's going to take me weeks to recover from all this, you know. It will. Right, more signs. At least we're getting signs now. But I've got to be careful because I've got to keep out. Poor luck. Where? See, you, West Poor Luck. Poor luck. Where? Straight ahead. Three quarters of a still. Do you know, I've been doing three quarters of an hour mile now for at least a mile and it's still three quarters of a mile. Right, over and out a minute.